Jose Feliciano in 1969 hired Johnny to play bass for the television show called Feliciano. The half-hour show was a mix of styles that showcased Jose's versatility. Johnny impressed Feliciano by being able to follow his guitar playing without the use of music charts. Before Johnny left the show, he wrote out his bass parts for Feliciano to use with any future bass players. Guests like Vicky Carr, Jimmy Witherspoon, Big Dana, Big Mama Thornton, Morgana King, and Ann Richards were only a few of the stars that performed. The wide range of songs included Light My Fire, Sabor A Mi, Hound Dog, and so many more. Jose Feliciano, that was another story. They needed a bass player. So I was a very good bass player. I could read, I could write, I could do everything they asked for. Jose Feliciano says, my name is Jose Feliciano and yours is Johnny Martinez, right? I said, yes, sir. He says, um, well, just follow me, Johnny. Says, I can't tell you exactly how I'm going to do it, but just watch me because everything's going to be more or less ad lib. I'll do some things on the guitar, and if you find a nice movement with the bass, do it. And so we tried one song at the studio, and Jose Feliciano says, he's perfect, he's good. I have a good ear for music, so I could tell when the changes were coming and what they have to go to. So it was easy for me because I knew my instrument, and I knew what I was doing, and I knew what they wanted. A Bailar Señores was another fun story which made it a perfect pick for the album title. One day I was irritated with the crowd. Well, we started noticing that the men were not dancing as much as the ladies. So um, I used to say, come on you guys, let's dance. A Bailar Señores, come on, dance. I'm going to write a song about that. So I did it was saying something to these guys to get off their duff and, <laughs> and dance. They started to dance a little bit and once they got going then they started do dancing to all the songs and they were happy. But that's more or less why I did it. Playtime in Havana, uh, I used to hear a band that used to come from Havana. They used to have violins, they call them charanga band. A charanga band is violins and flute. And they do that cha-cha, they do all their songs in charanga fashion. Charanga music, it's like uh, American music has its country music. It's a very typical sound. When I was working with this band and some company came to the band leader and asked him for some Latin music, like uh, charanga style. Well, we couldn't do it, because we had no violins, we had no flutes. So I says, well, why don't I write something? So next time we went to record, I had, I think it was four or six, uh, that were charanga tunes, you know, violins and flutes. And they were really nice, I like them. I, like I still like charanga. Mm -hmm. 